A new development in one local community is forcing some people right out of their homes. But there is some good news here. They are getting more time to find a new place to live. Vic Gideon has the story first at four. John Carroll's $100 million modernization plan taking shape. It includes converting six apartments around campus into student housing, leaving people who currently live there in limbo. However, some tenants, like Fairmont Villas, recently received some good news. They did receive uh, our standard one-year lease extension. Gene Harper has lived in Fairmont Villas for the last six years. Like other tenants, she doesn't want to leave. We are a community, and this is our home now. And we're, we're stable. We're here. We want to stay here. I am 70 years old, and John Carroll is effectively evicting me and my wife. The negotiations continue for Shaker to rezone the area to allow three buildings to become student housing by 2026 after renovation and modernization. But it's not certain that will happen. We were disappointed that Shaker Heights uh, established amendments back in February that restricted the intended use of the additional three buildings around Fairmont Circle. Renovations have already begun on three buildings, with the future of the other three still up in the air. What is known for certain is three buildings will be ready for students coming next school year, beginning in the fall of 2024. All of this is part of modernizing our campus, making it more attractive for the modern student, and you know, recruiting students from well beyond Northeast Ohio. And the Fairmont Circle Apartments are a big part of that investment plan to give upper class students a modern, uh, independent area to live. John Carroll expects to bring a new rezoning plan to Shaker Heights Council for the final three buildings this fall. Vic Gideon, 19 News. Well, you could soon see Dolly Parton's